Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so for today's video, since you guys liked the um, Americans Trying British Candy video so much with my mom, we're going to be doing a second one, but today we're going to be trying Australian candy. So we have like, I think I counted as like 23 different things to try here, which is a lot. Wow. Um, like here. Like this doesn't even fit everything that we're supposed to try. Like there's still some, <laughs> there's still some extra stuff on the table, so... So yeah, I think we're just gonna get into it. Yeah. All right. Okay. Ready. So first, the first thing we're gonna try because we just toasted it is we're gonna try toast with Vegemite, which I'm kind of nervous. I'm nervous too. Yeah. This regular Marmite yeast extract. So when I was looking up how to do it, I read that you're only supposed to put like a really thin amount on there, not like a whole bunch. So I'm just gonna try to spread it like thinly on the toast and see. Okay, so this is what it looks like when we put it on. Hopefully that is like a thin enough layer. Do you have yours? Yeah. So, wait. What does it smell like? It smells kind of like, it smells kind of like salty almost. Yeah. I don't know. Okay, let's try Ready? it. Tastes salty. That's not horrible, but it's not like something I would ever like go out of my way to eat. Mm. What is that? That's like the weirdest, dis most distinct taste. Mm. It just tastes like straight swamp. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's try it with some margarine. Okay. I'd mm -hmm. say that's better. So we're gonna try it with putting some margarine on it to see if. Cheers. <laughs> so now we have it with the margarine and the Vegemite on it. That's better to me. Mm -hmm. I still would rather have just plain toast. Yeah. With butter. Mm -hmm. But it's not bad. I was nervous because whenever I see people trying it, they always freak out. It's like different. It's like the worst thing ever, but it's not horrible. No. It's, it's, it's different. just different, yeah. Because mm -hmm. we have the bread out. We're just going to try the... There's this thing, I guess, called fairy bread in Australia. And they put... So someone told me I should cut off the crusts on it. So we have the crust cut off. And then you put margarine on it with... Well, they use these special sprinkles called hundreds and thousands, I think. But I looked it up, and so we kind of got the same thing. It's just like, it's just like these sprinkle type things. So hopefully this is like... A good substitute for it. Is there something that they use this fairy bread for? Do you know? I don't know. Someone told me it was like their childhood, so I don't know. Hairish, probably. Oh. I don't know if it's like a childhood thing, like that kids eat, or like if adults eat it. In the comments, can you guys let us know whether yeah. or not adults eat this, or if it's just something that kids eat? Because I'm wondering. This is something I would have. <laughs> it's something <laughs> I, I would have eaten. Yeah. <laughs> But is it like <laughs> breakfast or like? Oh yeah, that's a good like question. Like a, a birthday treat or. What is it? Because yeah. sprinkles is like, to us, is birth a birthday yeah. kind of thing, right? That's true, actually. I didn't think about that. You would think it'd be like a breakfast thing or maybe a dessert. Yeah. Or like, you know, you can have special, like, pancakes on your birthday, like with yeah. chocolate chips or something. I don't know. But it sounds like something that they eat, like, frequently. Oh. Like, it's not like a special occasion thing. Oh. I mean, I could be wrong, but... Let us know. Yeah. <laughs> Let us know. Sprinkles. Oh, they're so pretty. I'm not sure how much we're supposed to put on there, so Ooh. I'll put like a medium amount. Like I kind of just fell everywhere. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I hope this is enough. So we have like this that much on right. there. I'll just let us know if that looks right. I'm gonna fold mine to see. Okay. Fold to keep them up. <laughs> Why is it good? <laughs> That's actually good. I want to try adding more sprinkles. That's like sweet I like and that. buttery, uh -huh. aka my two favorite things. Mm. Want more sprinkles? Yeah. <laughs> Load them up. Life's better with sprinkles. Mm. This is good. I can see why people eat this. What does it remind me of? It's like sweet butter uh -huh. with bread. You can't really go wrong. Mm -mm. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Nice job, oh, I forgot you guys. to rate them. Oh. So for the Vegemite, what do you rate that? Oh. I read it like a three. I don't, I don't even know. Like one, a and one, a half. one and a half. 
<laughs> I'll rate it like a two and a half because it's okay. not like this. it's probably something that you get, you know like you're raised with. Yeah, maybe? exactly. Yeah, you know. And then for the the fairy bread, what do you? Oh, I'd rate it like start. an eight. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> I'm surprised. I feel like so like... I know because it looks weird, right? Do you, you want mine? Yeah, I want the rest of it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, it, who like would, I would have never thought. Yeah. You know, but yeah, I would say, yeah, seven or an eight. Uh-huh. Do you want to okay. pick the next thing? Then? Um, yeah, I do. Because I don't know what it is about this. Oh, okay, yeah, I just, freckles. I just think it's cute. How cute. I don't even know what it is. They're called chocolate. See, the it says hundreds and thousands. So like, oh, this is like so the, sprinkles. the sprinkles. Yeah. yeah so you can see if there's hundreds and thousands on this is different than what we put on the fairy bread. Yeah. Oh, oh. how oh. pretty. It kind of looks the same. It's not quite the same. Okay, you ready? Yeah, they look like non pareils. Mm. Except non pareils That's here good. have white sprinkles, right? Yeah. Mmm, that's good. There's nothing bad about this. Wow. Mm hmm You can't go wrong. I mean, no. it's chocolate and sprinkles, but... These are, like, addictive. Like, I could easily... Uh -huh. Eat the whole bag? Eat the whole bag. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, nice. Mm-hmm. What do you write? The name's cute. Mm -hmm. With the name, I would give it, like, a nine and a half. Like a nine and a half. I'd give it, yeah. like, a nine. Okay, it's yummy. Okay, I have been wanting to try these so bad. They're what called is it? Mars Pods. So like you know, there's Mars bars. Yeah. Which I haven't ever tried a Mars bar either, but I guess they sell them in like these little pod things, okay. like little pods on the bottom. I don't know. It just looks good and cute, you know. You haven't had a Mars bar? No. Have you had a Mars bar? Yeah, I think so. So this is. Here's what it looks like. Ooh. Looks like that. Like a literal pod. It almost feels like a baby cookie. Yeah. Right? They call them biscuits. Oh, yeah. baby biscuits. Baby mm -hmm. biscuits. <laughs> That's so good. I don't know if there's anything better than I this. I love candy so much. I... Oh my gosh. I think I'm in love. The crunchy bottom mm -hmm. with the caramel inside, it's just like just the a tiny soft. bite. That's caramel, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. This is a nice. I don't want to rate it a ten already. I know. Because we just started, but like I would rate that a nine point five, possibly a ten. But I don't want to go like to a ten yet, because I might like something more. Mm. I don't know. I'm pretty close to a ten, and if there's another ten, maybe they can share. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So good. Mm. Okay. I just like the bite part. Yeah, like, perfect size, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, my turn, and I've been dying Tim Tams, yes. my whole life to try these. So we got this flavor, and then we also got the regular original, oh. so this one's the caramel. No, I want to try the original. You want to try the original first? Okay. Sorry, I'm switching. I think these are called biscuits, I think, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I get confused now, it's like the, what their word for like a cookie is. Oh. Like I would call this like a cookie type thing, but I think the people in Australia call it a biscuit. I'm not sure. Not I could be sweet. wrong. I have no idea. Ooh, this looks good. Looks like that. The feel of it feels like a chocolate covered graham cracker. Yeah, what do you it think? Does. Yeah? That's kind of what it looks like on the inside. It looks like a cookie type thing, you know? Okay. Ooh, I'm excited. Okay. I want to try these for so long. <laughs> Me too. My whole life, actually. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. So this is what the inside looks like. What is that stuff in the middle? I have no idea. The whole bunch of goodness. I didn't know mm. if we, what is it? It says biscuit on there. Oh, okay. So it is a biscuit. Um, um, what is that stuff in the middle though? Just amazing. <laughs> so good. Oh, you're having another. <laughs> <laughs> this is a <laughs> This is why I saved my 10. Mm. This is a 10. Wow, so far I'm loving everything. I need to move to oh Australia. Gosh, no yeah. kidding. I don't even know what to say. This is probably, it's right next to Freckles. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm. Hey. Okay. Next, wanna just try the caramel one yeah, right after so that, right on. so that we have it in a fresh in our minds. So then these are just the, 
chewy caramel Tim Tams. And I love caramel. What is Tim Tam? I wonder if that is. I don't know. Name it says something about a horse on the back. Oh, there's a story. Like it was like named after a horse or something. I don't know. That's what I read on the other one. I think so. Interesting. Okay. It smells different. Mm. <laughs> how is that better? Um, it is. Than the other one. It's definitely better. But how? The caramel. Because I just give the other one a 10. So what is mm -hmm. this then? The yeah, point one. <laughs> <laughs> My gosh. And you know what I like the biscuit part? It's just like light. Yeah, it's uh -huh. light. That's what it uh -huh. is. I like how it's light. Okay. Mm, yummy. That was so good. I'm so excited to try the rest of this stuff now. <laughs> so yeah, burger rings. They're like they're like chips, but they're like chips, but I think they're like burger flavored and also in like a ring shape. Oh, they're cute. Oh, oh they're, they're baby, smaller than I thought. They're baby onion rings. Okay. The physical feel it feels like kind of like a Cheeto. Yeah, like a Cheeto kind of. That's pretty good. It's kind of oniony. Yeah, I do like it though. This is like the same thing. In our Britain or our British candy video, we said the same thing. Where I said the same thing. Where I feel like it's not my my favorite thing, but I would just eat like the whole mm -hmm. box, what is the whole bag. Of? It's because like addictive. Like barbecued potato chip fish. Oh yeah. Yeah. Except Cheeto texture. Mm. Those are good. I mean, those are like mm -hmm. pretty good. I like. I don't know. What would you rate them? I'd give it an 8, honestly. I'd give them like a 7-ish. Like, okay. they're pretty good. Okay, so next thing we're going to try is called a Cherry Ripe. And it says it's ripe, juicy cherries and coconut in old gold, rich, dark chocolate. Mm. Which, I'm not a huge fan of cherries, like, when it's candy. Ooh. So I don't know how I like this. Very, very. That's what the inside looks like. Okay. I don't like that that much. It's not horrible. No, it's not have, horrible. Does it have coconut in there, did I mm -hmm. say? I taste the coconut. I'm not a huge fan of coconut either. Like, we when we tried, like, mounds or whatever in the other video. Right. I don't like those either, just because the coconut flaky, like, texture is kind of weird. It's good, I just... Like, I wouldn't turn it away. But, I like, really with all the other though. stuff... Yeah, I don't taste cherry either, yeah. actually. It's, it's okay. It's kind of mountain borage. Yeah, yeah I, get, I get more of like a coconut flavor. That's yeah. true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would rate it like a... Four. I would rate it like a five. Okay. Like it's like literally just like average to me. Yeah. No right. shade. <laughs> Let's try this. It's the way it shatters that matters. So this one is called a violet crumble. And I think it's honeycomb. Is it? Doesn't say... Yeah, del delicious shattering chocolate coated honeycomb. I wonder what it is that shattered. Yeah. Like, is it gonna break apart? Go ahead. Ooh, pops. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's such a weird texture, but in like such a good way. It's like air candy. Yeah. It oh. literally melts in your mouth. I would have never guessed. Me either. When you take a bite of it, it's like airy. Yeah. And it literally does shatter. Mmm. I really like this. That's good. I do. I really like it. Yeah. <laughs> I think because it's so different. It's like way different from I've any never had candy I've ever tasted yeah. before. I'll never get tired of the whole shattering no. thing. <laughs> I think that's the fun of it. Mm -hmm. Almost like, not quite like pop rocks, but yeah, I kind of. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What do you rate it? Mm. A nine. A nine. Mm -hmm. I'd probably rate like an eight. I like the shattering, but I'm more of a fan of like, or like traditional American chocolate type stuff. Mm. If that makes sense. But like, I feel like if I grew up on this, I would probably like love it. Like, yeah. It's probably like my favorite thing. Okay. Let's switch it up with um. Oh yeah. Oh. So 
I have an eye in those. Yeah, so these are called lambing pins. I don't know if you guys can really see what that looks like in, with the plastic wrap, but it's called a sponge cake covered in chocolate coating and rolled in coconut. But it sounds good. I wish it didn't have coconut, but we'll see. I like coconut. Do you? Um, yeah, I do. I don't mind it. Ooh, that is soft. Oh my gosh. Just Will you share? share the same one. Mm -hmm. Okay. You can tell it's like super soft. Like. Can I touch it? Yeah. Oh. It is like yeah. a sponge. It's sponge cake. Yeah. That's so soft. Wow. It's pretty good. Mm. Kind of like a, yeah, kind of sponge cake, strawberry shortcake, cake, you know, those little yeah. cakes. That's what it reminds me of, kind of like. Yeah. Reminds me of like angel food cake. Oh, yeah. Angel food cake. That's what it tastes like. It's good though. I like the texture. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is nice. I wonder, what do you guys eat these with? Something like tea or something? Yeah, I was just gonna say tea. Mm -hmm. What do you um, rate it? A seven? Oh. I rate like a seven too. Yeah. You're okay, my good. turn. Okay, so I'm gonna eye on these yeah. too. Okay, so these are called cheesels. Um, they're like cheese flavored snacks. They look like the same shape as like the burger rings. Oh yeah. Oh, but they look like, you know what they look like? Calamari rings. Oh my God, you can smell those. That smells like Velveeta cheese. Ooh. It smells good. So that's what it looks like on the outside. But you can smell them. Like they taste, they smell like so cheesy. cheesy. You ready? Mm. I love that. What is that similar to though? It's not. I'm getting like a similar appetite. Like a cheese it? Kind of. Kind of. Almost kind of like baked Cheetos. Not like the regular Cheetos, but like baked Cheetos. They're definitely cheesy. Mm-hmm. I can smell it as soon as the box is opened. Mm-hmm. I would eat these. Like, I would pick these out of the store. Mm-hmm. Plus, I'm going to have like a movie night with some snacks. Oh, definitely. Definitely. Yeah, like an alternative to popcorn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Um, what do you I'll say? I'm like a 9, like an 8.59. Yeah, I'd say 8.5. Well, yeah. uh -huh. they're addictive though. That's what I hate about things like Cheez-Its and like Cheetos is like you want to keep eating them because they're like, mm -hmm. the aftertaste is so good kind of. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. uh, no, no, put those over there. <laughs> <laughs> it's my turn, right, to pick? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So next thing, they're called Jaffa's. They're chocolate orange in a crispy shell. Mm. They kind of look like M&M's kind of. Yeah, like peanut M&M's. Just like an orange, like it's like a simple ball of like. Yeah. Hard. Oh, wow. You don't like those? No. So for some reason my camera stopped recording. I don't know if it caught that my mom didn't like these. Yeah. <laughs> but she's not a fan. I don't know. It's Orange and chocolate is kind of like a weird thing to put together, but they're not mm. bad for me either. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm just like so easily pleased. That's why I'm like the worst person to do these videos because I like love every single sweet ever. They're okay. I just... Maybe it's just orange and chocolate. Yeah. What do you mm. rate them? What do you think? I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. Really? What do you, yeah. you don't like that much? Maybe like a two or three. Really? <laughs> yeah. I rate like a 6.5. Which are pretty good, but... What, so what's weird about it to you? You just like the orange part? The orange doesn't really taste like orange. It tastes like fake orange. Mm, right, I see what you mean. Oh, I knew oh. you. I thought you might would like these. Because she loves gummy candy. I do. Like, it's her favorite. You know what? Favorite. Gummy candy makes the world go around. So they're just like regular gummy snakes. Um, are they different flavors? Does it say different flavors? Doesn't say. Well, let's just try it. It doesn't say. Oh, yeah. This one's quite... Mm. It's not the kind of gummy that I'm used to. Mm -hmm. But I like it. The texture is good. Mm. I believe they are different flavors. Mm -hmm, they are. Mm -hmm. I would say this one's my favorite kind of the tangerine color. 
I'll try this one then, if it's your favorite. Yeah, I think so. That one is good. Yeah. Yeah. When do you rate it? I give it a seven. I'd probably go for like a five just because I don't love gummy candy. It's not uh. like my favorite. But like if you like gummy candy like she does, yeah. then you would like it. Okay, so next thing we want to try is the Carmelo Koala. It's like the same thing kind of as the Freddo Frog that they had mm -hmm. in Britain, but it has caramel in the middle. I read about this one. Have you really? Yeah, I wanted to, I've been wanting oh, to try this cute. one. Oh, it's cute. It looks like a literal, Aww. it looks like an actual koala. He's That's so cute. cute. He's cute. Ooh. Ooh. That caramel pull. That's so good. I love caramel and chocolate mm -hmm. though. It's like my favorite. Mm -hmm. That's so yummy. Mm -mm -mm. Plus he's cute. Yeah. I'd give it an 8. If I was a kid, I would love that. Because of the shape mm -hmm. or the tip? It was yeah. Nice. yeah. I'd give it like a 9. Yeah. Okay. It's a good size too, you know? Yeah, like a snack. Mm-hmm. He looks a so... happy little guy. He looks so jolly on the... <laughs> yeah. He's like... <laughs> he, he's so happy. He's, uh, he's like ready to go. <laughs> yeah, let's do this. Yeah, they're called the Cadbury Clinkers. And they look cute. I mean, they've got little colors. Yeah, it looks like Easter egg. Yeah, oh yeah. They're like almond shaped. Cheers. <laughs> I'm surprising. I don't like that. I'm it's just actually surprised. Right. The aftertaste isn't horrible. I didn't expect the middle to be like that. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. The inside is like chalky, kind of. It almost has the same um, texture as the violet crumble. The crumble, except. But it tastes like bubble gummy, kind of, doesn't it? Yeah. Nothing about gum. No. <laughs> I swear it tastes like gum, though. That's so weird. Mm. I rate it like, um, a five? Yeah, six, six four. Five point five. I would say a four. No. I, I don't know if I would actually go out of my way. This reminds me of something like that you would have at your grandma's house. Yeah. Because you have, like, nothing yeah, else yeah, to eat yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's, like, the only candy she, she loves clinkers. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, like, I can just imagine Grandma Betty having those just right. in a bowl. Right, right. Just hanging out. Alongside the And then you're, else. like, bored, so you're, like, oh, I guess I'll have the clickers. <laughs> okay, so the next one. We missed this one. It's called a crunchy. We missed this in our uh, British video, but I think that Australian have, and Britain have, like, a carryover of, like, because the, they both have a lot of Cadbury. Oh. So they share a lot of the same um, What do you mean candies? you missed it? Well, we didn't miss it, but I just didn't try it, even though apparently oh, it's like a oh, popular. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. We didn't so I just get didn't it. buy it. Okay. Yeah. I was like, well, I think we ate everything out uh. of that box. Hmm? What's the. Is that honeycomb too? Golden. Butterfingers. Mm -hmm. Golden hokey pokey honeycomb covered in Cadbury milk chocolate. It's like Butterfinger. You don't like it? Butterfinger's better. Really? Mm-hmm. Mm. No, I like it. What's I wonder what's different between the violet crumble. That tastes like honey. This is more peanut buttery taste. I to me. Yeah. But you you don't like it. Let me try the violet crumble again. They taste pretty similar to me. It's just this one's more like chalky. And like shattery. Hmm. This one tastes more peanutty to me. You like um, it more? Yeah. Well, I like them the same. What would you rate this one? I would say the same as a violet crumble, probably an eight or a nine. I would rate it like a six ish. Mm. It's not horrible, but mm. it's funny that um, Australians have a lot of honeycomb because we don't have anything honeycomb in the States really. Mm -mm. And nothing with this. Well, yeah. unless we're missing something, I don't know anything yeah. with this texture. I'll try to show the inside. Oh yeah. I'm like nervous to try this though because last time we messed up on the 
I'm wanting, Rabina. I've been wanting to try it's this. It's called Milo. It's kind of like a um, Nesquik powder or like chocolate milk powder. Oh. We have to, <laughs> clearly we have to add it to something. Yeah. Because if you watched our British candy video. It was a fail we, on the funny, no, the, My favorite part about the whole thing though, Mom, is that when you tried it without it diluting it, like you liked it. <laughs> like you genuinely <laughs> liked it. Like for me, I was like, eh, it's thick. And you're like, I like it. Non-diluted. Super sweet. <laughs> no, like everyone was commenting, you have to dilute it. We're like, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so it just says three heaped teaspoons. One. Two. Three, and then add milk and stir. There's like, I don't know if there's supposed to be like stuff left at the top, but it's like not stirring in all the way. Maybe but the whisk it or something. I'm just gonna try it. Okay. <laughs> this is what it looks like like that. Let's see. I wonder if it was hot, if it would. Yeah, it tastes like chocolate milk. That's good. You don't like it? Too chalky. Too chalky. I'm gonna try the stuff at the top. So there's like this like stuff at the top. I don't know if it's supposed to. How is that? Good? Yeah. I've had better chocolate milk before. It's not horrible. I had it like a three? A three. Yeah. yeah, I'd write it like a 4.5 maybe. Okay. Around there. Hopefully we did it right. I hope so. Let us know too, if yeah. we did that wrong. Please. Yeah, I don't, I don't <laughs> know. Okay, so next we could try... They're called Shapes. They are... We got, I got the original barbecue flavor. There's like a whole bunch of flavors. It's kind of like... Oh, really? But this, their barbecue is like the original for some reason. Oh, they're cute. So they look like that on the outside. They're literally just like shaped like. This is original. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. I like it. It's like light in flavor. Mm -hmm. It kind of reminds me of like those Ritz crackers, not the um, not the actual round Ritz crackers or the other ones, but the ones that are in the bag and flavored. Oh, I know what you mean. Mm -hmm. Kind of reminds me of those. Yeah, I do. I like it. What would you rate it? Um, I'd say seven. A seven? Yeah. I'd rate like a 7.5-ish about. Mm -hmm. So next we're going to try, they're called fan Fantales. Fantales. Oh. I don't know how to pronounce it. I thought it said Fantales. But Fantales maybe? Yeah. Maybe. Chewy caramel with a rich chocolate coating. Can't go wrong. Oh, it's like a bubblegum wrapper type thing. They're just like a little chocolate thing. Like that. Kind of like the, the wrapping kind of reminds me of like British. Whoops. That's so hard. Wow. <laughs> I'm just stuck in my suit. <laughs> wow. I love it because it tastes really good, mm -hmm. and I wouldn't be able to eat a lot. Because <laughs> you can't, because <laughs> your jaw gets tired. But I'm just now finally chewing through it. Mm -hmm. mm. It's good, The though. flavor is good, though. Mm. What do you rate it? A nine. A nine? Uh-huh. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Makes you kind of drooly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're like drooling because you're chewing it so much. Mm -hmm. I rate like a seven. Mm. Eight, 7.58. Mm. I like it. It is hard to chew. I want to like put a whole bunch in my mouth, but I can't. You cannot. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, so next we're going to try, they're called Jersey Caramels. I don't know if this is like the super correct brand of them. I just saw, I was like looking at lists on like what candy to get, and I saw Jersey Caramels, and so I don't know if there's like a specific brand, but. What do you mean like the Jerseys? Yeah, I'm not sure if like a whole bunch of places sell them and this could be like an off-brand thing or not. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We had something like this, what was it? I don't like that that much. No. 
You would think it'd be like chewier. It says deliciously chewy, but it's not chewy. And it doesn't like, taste like caramel much. It tastes like, like whatever the weight is. It kind of just like breaks apart. Like it's almost kind of like dry. Yeah, like a nougat kind of. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I still don't hate it because <laughs> I just ate more, but. Would you but, like <laughs> <laughs> but they're like, it's not what I expected, I guess. Yeah. Like looking at it. Like yeah. If you look at them, you think they'd be like chewier. Or more caramely. Yeah, but they're not. Yeah. What do you rate them? Three or four. Three or four. Yeah, I'd probably go like a five. Yeah? Yeah. I mean, okay. it's not like the worst thing I've ever tried. It's not horrible. It's just... I we keep saying that. We're like, it's not the worst thing, but like yeah. average, no? <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't yeah. go out of my way for that one. Yeah, me either. It's almost like too sweet, kind of, because it's like so dry. It tastes like it's just like sugar. Straight sugar. Yeah, mm -hmm. like straight mm -hmm. sugar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Must, Must sticks. Stick. Sweet and soft with a what, cherry tree. What a cherry tree. Cherry tree. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It almost kind of looks like what our licorice would be. Maybe. Maybe. Feels different. <laughs> you know what it tastes like? It tastes like soap. I don't know. It almost like it tastes like a pixie stick that got wet. Yeah, <laughs> like and you're eating the paper on the pixie stick too. I'm I don't sorry, know, like guys. I'm, yeah, I'm sorry, but like I just don't like those that much. A two? Yeah, like a two. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, sorry guys. My camera died, so we had to switch out to my um, other camera because I'm at my mom's house right now and I forgot to bring a spare battery. Um, so hopefully it looks okay. I can't really tell. This is just, I'm just using my vlogging camera right now. So we only have like a couple things left to try. So we just tried the musk sticks and we didn't right. like those. And so we're going to do the Turkish Delight. The bar that is different, soft eating, Turkish Delight covered with milk chocolate. So what's the Turkish Delight then? Interesting. Ooh. What the heck? Ooh. <laughs> Whoa. That's so oh, weird. it's kind of jelly. Yeah, that's like jelly in the inside. Gummy? I was not expecting that. Wow. This is exciting to try, right? It is. Yeah. It's almost yeah, I like that a lot. <laughs> it's almost kind of like. Mm. I can't quite wrap my brain around this. The texture is like chocolate covered gummy bears. But it's almost like um, real gelatin jelly, like like Welch's grape jelly. Yeah. Right? But like harder. Yeah, like real gelatin-ish. Mm -hmm. Good job. What would, you, wait, what would you rate that? I can't put my finger on whether I like it or not. That's the weirdest thing. I, I like it. I like it. I would give it like a 7. Yeah, I guess I'll say a 7 too. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I no. can't decide whether I want to rate it like a 2 or a 9. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I can't. Crazy. That's the weirdest thing I've ever tried. <laughs> okay. Okay, the next thing is a tiny teddy. Tiny teddy. Half coated in milk chocolate. So it looks like maybe like um like graham things. Do they have different faces on them? <gasps> they do. This one's angry. Oh <laughs> wait, so this one's angry. What is this one? This one looks bashful. He has like his hand over his Mouth. I don't know what this one's doing, but he's cute. How cute. Mm hmm They're so expressive. Yeah, right? They're like, they it's have their own personalities. <laughs> yeah. It's emoji treats. Oh, I think it's yawning when it has its hand over its mouth, like it's tired. Yeah. These are addicting. It's gonna have like a whole handful of them. Mm -hmm. These are good. I like them. These are like another 10 for me. I would give it a 9. I'm gonna have more after we're done filming. Okay. <laughs> those, those are good. <laughs> I'm gonna dip them in milk or something. Oh, there you go. Okay, so this is our last thing, I guess. Um, It's the Arnott's Iced Vovo. Which is another like biscuit thingy. Ooh, they're pretty. 
mean, this is the back part. This is cool. Cheers. I like it. Really? Mm -hmm. It's very like, um, it's kind of strawberry. Flavor? Yeah, like strawberry, is it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I, I like Strawberry this. Like, and coconut. Oh. It sounds funny because I don't really taste coconut. A treasured biscuit favorite topped with pink fondant, a strip of jammy raspberry topping, and a raspberry. sprinkling of coconut. Raspberry. Not, not strawberry. This is good. These I would eat. Yes. They're good. Mm -hmm. They're addictive. I would say sure. nine. I'll go get eight on these. These are good. Mm. What was your favorite out of everything we tried? Um, I know what mine is. What is the tiny teddies? <laughs> <laughs> the tiny teddies or the um, the Tim Tam. Mm -hmm. Where is those ultra hard? No, I love the freckles, and it's the so the freckles. The, the freckles was my favorite, and those really hard um, caramel things. Oh, the the fantallies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Those were your favorites too. Her favorite was the. This and the freckles. So our favorite was the Fantallies and the freckles. Mm -hmm. And mine is the Tim Tams, the Mars Pods, oh, or, that's true. or the Tiny Teddies. Do you have anything else you want to say? No. No. no I enjoyed it though. Enjoy. I did enjoy your candy. Yeah. Australia. Australia. <laughs> yeah. So that's, I guess that's the end of this video. It was really fun trying different Australian yeah. candies. Uh -huh. And if you want to see us try more different foreign candies, just let us know like what kind in the comments because yeah. I don't know what kind we, we would do next. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Bye.